having the magnet, it's pushing, spreading, so the shoulder's in a safe position. We're up, good. He's gonna rotate as a board. The whole spine is gonna come over, good. Excellent, core, squeeze the glutes. There it is, there's that activation. His head is tucked, spine is working well, really working hard. Five, four, three, two, one. It's gonna rotate as a board, boom. Now, he's cheating there and there. The inside bone isn't touching, so all of these muscles are working across the whole entire area. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. It's rotating onto his stomach again. Core tight, chin is tucked, squeeze. That's the activation. Glutes and abs, come on, squeeze. Three, two, one. He rotates again as a board. Everything moves as one. Good. He's cheating. Inside of the ankle doesn't touch. Magnet, magnet. And he is sweating, working hard. Five, four, three, two, one. Down. Bam. And that's a nice routine as well. For the more advanced athletes that are really trying to build stability in their core, this cooks it. We would do this at the end of the practice, maybe five minutes. We could rotate through that. They could use a soccer cleat, putting it on their back. A sneaker, doesn't matter. Just something so that they really have to make their spine perfectly straight. That's a good way to prevent injuries.